How to replace the collet in your Shofu Lab Air Z handpiece. First thing we're going to do is remove any burr that's in the turbine. So I'm going to do that by just depressing the plunger down and taking the burr out of the handpiece. Next thing we need to do is remove the turbine itself from the handpiece. So I'm going to do that by putting my cartridge wrench on here, turning it counterclockwise, and just threading the turbine out of the handpiece. Now we're going to set our handpiece off to the side and we're going to just work with our turbine. In the back of the turbine, if you look close in the shaft, there's a little slotted uh, nut down in there that you need to take out in order to get the collet out. You'll use your tool here with the slotted end and insert that into the back of the turbine and just rotate it until you feel it grip in the slots. So now we have our tool in the back of the turbine in the slots. Next thing we're going to do is just hold the red anodized rotor on the back of the turbine with our fingers and we're going to turn our wrench clockwise so it's left hand threads. So normally tightening but this is going to loosen it. So we're turning the nut clockwise until we feel it release out of the handpiece. So I'm going to just give it a few extra turns here. You'll feel it kind of click when it's out. It won't come out yet, but just tighten or go all the way to the right until you feel it, until it feels like it's really loose. We're going to then turn the turbine around and use the other end of our tool, push the tool through the front of the turbine, and we're going to just push it down in there until it pushes the collet and the nut out of the turbine. So now we have our turbine and we just push the collet out and the little keeper here on the back that we just threaded out is also there. Okay, once we have our collet out of the turbine, it's time to put in the new collet. So on the end of the collet, there's a short cylinder end and a longer cylinder end. It's very important that you insert the short cylinder end into the turbine first. So we're gonna take the short cylinder end of our collet and put it into the back of the turbine. We're going to then use our collet tool here and we're going to push the back of it up into the turbine until we hear it click. It just clicked as it went in all the way. We're going to then take our keeper here and put it back in the end. It's got a tapered end on it and the slotted end. The tapered end goes into the back of the turbine first. So we're going to insert that into the turbine and then we're going to use the slotted end of our collet tool to thread that in. So you'll want to push it in just a little ways till it hits the back of the collet. And then these are left hand threads remember, so we're going to tighten this nut counterclockwise until it's all the way in. So we're going to give it a few turns here. And it'll go down in there quite a ways and it'll actually stop when it's in all the way. So it just stopped on me. Let's see if we can get a really close up view here of how far it's down in there. I'm guessing it's down in there a good eighth of an inch down in there and it'll actually stop when it's in all the way. So just thread that nut into the back as far as you can get it counterclockwise until it stops and just give it one little snug and you should be good. So there's the process of replacing the collet in your Shofu Lab Air Z oil-free handpiece.